Festival of Marketing, lots of speakers, 200 of them over two days. One of them is Tom Goodwin, the Executive Vice President of Zenith. What are you talking about? I'm going to talk about the changing world. Uh, there's a lot of people going out there saying that everything is different. There are many profound technological changes happening to the world, but not everything matters. So I'm here to try and draw a line through the profound changes and the gimmicks. From a marketing point of view, what does that actually mean then? It, it sounded a little bit waffly, you know, global change and all that. <laughs> it means looking at behaviours really, looking at people, how is technology changing their life, how is it not changing their life, what opportunities does that create for brands, um, how does that change the fundamental business dynamics of the world right now and what should people be doing about it? When we look at marketing and how we actually sort of move forward we see lots of trends like the move towards sort of purpose marketing and that sort of thing what are you predicting I'm predicting that companies that make better products that convey that simply to people and then make it easy for them to buy um, will perform best. Now a part of that will be building a very strong brand and a part of that will be giving people a brand story or a narrative that helps them make that decision. But I think to use something like purpose driven marketing which has been around for 100 years and to talk about it as a new thing or something that's deeply profound is slightly misleading. You talked about making it as simple as possible for the consumer to figure out sort of what's right for them. Isn't that actually old fashioned itself? You used to have features, advantages, benefits, and that's how you'd promote your, your product. Yeah, I mean, you're absolutely right. And I think our industry needs to understand that everything that we learned for the previous 100 or 200 years should not be thrown away. What we now have is an environment where new technology can help us um, perform against the same strategies better. So we can now make it easier for people to buy. We can now provide them with better service. We can now do um, customer lifestyle management more effectively. So we need to take that contrast of the two. How do we kind of turbocharge the tactics that we've done before with an understanding of the new age? Which industries are doing best at this at the moment? I mean, generally speaking, and this is, uh, I don't feel comfortable saying this, like the larger companies tend to be worse at this. You know, the reality is that a fashion company with four people in a cupboard somewhere in Stockport probably has a better approach towards new technology than a 1,000 uh, retailer outlet. Um, so when you tend to look towards China, when you tend to look towards the smaller companies, it's that that you see the lessons that we can all learn from. Are we obsessed with technology? And where's your view on how <laughs> creative fits in with it? I think, uh, I mean, technology has never been more powerful. It never feels like it's been creating more change than it does do today. Um, so it's essential that we really understand it and we observe it. Uh, but for me personally, where things get more interesting is when we look at how that changes people's behaviors. Uh, how that changes people's expectations of the modern world. Like it, it's that that we need to be obsessed with rather than the technology itself. But it's certainly having a profound impact, impact on society, whether it's business models, whether it's global politics. Um, we would be idiotic to stick our heads in the sand. Uh, Zenith's 30th anniversary, happy birthday. What are you celebrating? What have been the best bits? Uh, we're celebrating 30 years of being incredible partners to global and local clients around the world, for being obsessed with the return on investment, being obsessed with being able to show the value of the skills that we add. Um, as time changes, so do we. We're now obsessed with data, we're obsessed with technology. Um, so I think we're all very proud to get to this stage in life and to know that we're still doing a great job 30 years on. Happy birthday. Thanks, Tom. Thank you very much. Hello, I'm James Wright. Thanks for watching Marketing Media Money. To check out more online videos, just click on the boxes and don't forget to subscribe to the CNBC Life channel at the bottom of the screen.